Uh, what's up everybody? You're watching Online Prosperity TV show and I'm honored to be here today. Uh, we're going to talk about how to start a profitable online business and we're going to talk about blogging and affiliate marketing as well as blogging. Welcome to yet another exciting episode of the Online Prosperity Show. And today we've got my man, Alex. Alex, how are you doing, buddy? I'm doing great, man. I'm doing great. Thanks for having me here today. Not a problem. Now, ladies and gentlemen, Alex reminds me a little bit about myself. When I was young, back in Africa, I um, was trying to get out, trying to do stuff, and I've noticed, um, you know, Alex has started his own platform where he's actually helping other freelancers coaches and bloggers to build an online profile all right and an online business now he's doing this out of kenya in africa where the internet is not the best where the equipment is not the best and where communication can be cut off um you know due to weather restrictions and things like that but he has managed to build something that is lucrative and has caught my attention now alex congratulations for what you've done so far and what you're doing and what you're about to do thanks so much man thanks so much man just taking a little bit of some time but it's totally worth it not a problem tell us a little bit about yeah. what you do and who you help there alex Oh, uh, well, well, uh, I, I started an online uh, business. Okay, it's a, it's a blog where I teach, I coach people who want to, be, to start an online business, you know, maybe blogging, affiliate marketing, and those who want to be freelance writing, you know, things like copywriting. So I, I share my insights, things that I've learned from people who have, who have been there, and share, I share the, those things with people. And... Yeah, they can learn something from there and see how they can start something profitable for themselves as well. Understandable. Well, that's a really yeah. um, good thing that you're doing, teaching other people, um, especially there in Africa, to start something online that would also um, be profitable. Now, what sort of um, hardships are you facing to make sure that this is a smooth uh, business for you then? Well, there, there are a lot of challenges, especially, you know, like be, starting an online online business is, uh, here in, in Kenya, okay, in Africa, especially in Kenya. Uh, people haven't embraced and, uh, uh, working online yet. People want the nine to five jobs. So it's really hard to convince people that you should start something online. Like the world is moving, everything is becoming digital. And that's where you should move also. So it's really hard to convince people. And get get them to start something online and something profitable for themselves and also back to, to business you know like blogging it's really hard to get traffic as, as a startup so it has taken me a lot of time to to get traffic to the, to my website to my business and and also people people to to help people to start people converting that business it's really hard it's really hard to get conversions and yeah, but it, 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 it takes a lot of time, but it's, um, I think it's getting there. Understandable. It's well worth it. And I would like to publicly acknowledge that I would like to help you out so that you too, um, you know, can foster your business and be able to help all the other people out there. All right. Now, what actually inspired you to start um, you know, this, this business, instead of you just going to work and start a nine to five, which is probably easier than Nairobi. Well, I, 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 okay. Back in college, when I was in college, I was doing interior design and I realized it, okay, as much as it was a bit, it was a bit interesting. I was, I, I loved it, but then I realized it's not going to take me where I want to be. And so a friend of mine actually introduced me to freelance writing. I, I was doing freelance writing, actually do a little bit of copywriting at, at, up to now yet. So a friend of mine introduced me to this and I thought I thought it's, it's, it's something that most people haven't tapped into, especially in Kenya. So I wanted to, you know, like be, help, help other, okay, like get into it and see how it, it goes and help other, other people too who have, not, who have not yet noticed so that they can also come in. Start something for themselves, yeah. 
Understandable. So what sort of uptake are you receiving from, you know, some of your peers? Are they supporting you or are they just looking at you as somebody who has lost their marbles? Well, it's really crazy. It's really crazy. You know, people, people think that, you know, they, they, they're always asking you, man, what, what are you doing? Why can't you do, do something that's, that's, that people can understand or maybe something lucrative? So it's it's hard. Not I, I'm not getting enough support from them, but I know it's maybe because it's a, it's it's still a startup. So and then I'm still you know getting challenges of consistency. So people 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 haven't yet uh, embraced it that much, and I'm not I'm not receiving the much uh, support that uh, I'd expect from them. But you know at least there there are those ones that are you know like they 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 telling me like. Yo, man, do you're, you're doing good and continue, continue whatever you're doing. And it's gonna get somewhere. Understandable. Well, obviously, yeah. like I've said, I mean, and you being on this platform, it does um, sort of mean you are doing considerable amount of work. And kudos to you for you know giving it a go. Now, what 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 sort of um, what sort of things do you help people with? And um, when somebody comes along to you uh okay so okay over time I've, I've done this for about one and a half years and over this time i, I have learned uh, a little bit of seo i've learned about the uh, blogging you know like how to write how to write uh, converting blog or blog posts and and also a little bit of affiliate marketing uh things like amazon 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 affiliate affiliates yeah and so those are the things that i always i always tell people to, okay, like when people, anyone approaches me, that's, those are the things that I always uh, teach them and you know, coach them how to, how to do, how, how to, how to get them to expose themselves to those things. Yeah. Understandable. That's also a really good thing that you can teach people to actually monetize their blogs so that they get rewarded for their efforts. Now, are you, you being a freelancer, do you also subscribe to uh, channels like freelancer.com or Fiverr or all those other channels that get, um, you know, ad work, work here and there? Yeah. Uh, okay. Uh, I used I used to to get my, most of my clients from from freelancer dot com and Upwork, but then with time I, re I realized you know the 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 pay there is not that good. It's, okay, it is good for for starters, but then if you know if you've progressed with time, you realize that that's that's the the pay is really small for 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 your level of expertise. So. I, I I dropped all those content meals and nowadays I'm getting clients from my blog. You know, people people who visit my blog and see whatever I'm doing, if they like it, most of them. That's why I get most of my clients from people those who want who want me to write the uh, content for them. To, yeah, so I just, I, 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 dro I dropped those those content meals uh, uh, some some time back. Yeah. Understandable. Well, obviously, as an entrepreneur and somebody who actually knows his way around, it looks like you've got it all set up there. Now, if somebody comes to you today, uh, Omari, and they want to get a hold of you, what's the best way that somebody can be in touch with you then? So the, the best the best way to get me is, is through email. Uh, they can email me from omari at freelancenuggets.com or they can get me on Facebook. I'm also on Facebook as Omari Alex and uh, and Instagram as Omari Alex underscore. Understandable. So if people follow you, you're going to follow them back, right? You're not going to be a brat. And <laughs> Absolutely. <laughs> Absolutely. <laughs> great. Great stuff. Well, yeah. it's been an absolute pleasure there, Alex. And, um, you know, you giving us your insight and your time to let us know what it is that you're doing um, how you're helping, uh, you know, change the, pers the perspective and also change the environment in Africa. Um, you know, the landscape there is people are just looking to go into a nine to five job, but you are challenging the status quo and doing something that even I, when I was in Africa, did not even think was possible. So kudos to you, um, you know, for, you know, taking the leap and actually going out there and doing what you actually and absolutely love uh, and if you're watching this show if you really want to support um alex uh, i will be putting in all his contact details at the bottom so that you too can figure out if you've got any content needs or if you've got anything that he um is capable of or him and his army 
can actually put together for you. As you can see, he is a legitimate young man who's really trying to, um, you know, make it in life doing what he absolutely loves, which is what we, um, you know, support and truly appreciate at this show. Now, Alex, thank you so much for your time, your expertise, and your story here on the Online Prosperity Show today. Thanks, thanks so much for having me, I mean, thank you. Not a problem, man. Yeah, and before, before I leave, I'd like to let people know that uh, online, online, online marketing and on, uh, digital marketing is the next big thing. And those people who really want to tap in, into this should start as soon as now. And, you know, like, uh, I, I've, I haven't done much of vlogging and podcasting, but I've, 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 I've always, I've, I've been doing, I've been blogging so much, I've spent most of the time uh, writing blog posts and stuff like that, but I have also started a, a vlog on my, uh, my YouTube channel where I'll be sharing insights about blogging and online marketing and all that. I'm also planning to start a, a podcast. So I'll, I'll, I'll share my, my detail, details about that time, yeah. Not a problem. Well, thank you so much for that information. And like I said earlier on, when we started, we're always here to support you just to make sure that your business becomes profitable and enjoyable. Thank you, man. Thank you so much, man.